back to after the uh, I Kerala High Court has dismissed it. Uh, and in fact, uh, you know, when we gather others were accused in various cases from the Malayalam film industry like Akta Mukesh, uh, Ida Vela Babu, all of them have got anticipatory bail. But to which, uh, the charges that's been filed against him are very serious. That includes rape charges also. And that's probably the reason why uh, the Kerala High Court has dismissed this anticipatory bail plea. The investigation team had submitted certain findings that uh, you know, uh, they have found an investigation that's been going on since the last one month. A detailed statement of around four hours, uh, you know, has, uh, the victim statement for around four hours was recorded. So, uh, all of those details as well as the details that the investigative team collected from uh, the, uh, you know, the place where this alleged incident took place were all submitted before the court. And the court said that the allegations do, it's not, it cannot be dismissed as mere allegations. There are, there is a ground in this case and that's why the industry bill has been dismissed. Uh, he argued in the petition, the industry bill petition that, uh, you know, these are baseless allegations. This is a very uh, planned conspiracy is what he said. Uh, there are certain uh, part of her uh, allegations that he uh, to include. Uh, you know, meeting her in the hotel, but he went on to argue in the court that uh, he met her along with with her parents. So her parents were full time there with her. So uh, the allegations are based There's nothing like rape that took place, is what uh, uh, the uh, actor argued in the high court. But uh, the investigative team uh, finding, uh, and that's why. Uh, that's All right, I'm going to thank you, Shivi Mol, getting us those details as far as. The Mollywood abuse controversy is concerned.